First time seeing that promo. Uh, you guys look pretty good, Todd and Dana. Nice. Happy to be in your company. Uh, winds today are going to stay on the light side. Uh, winds tomorrow, also light under 10 miles per hour. You know the deal around Las Vegas. Anytime you have light winds, uh, you have to enjoy it because that's not always the case. That won't be the case as we slide into your Thursday. Winds could pick up to 35 miles per hour Thursday afternoon. These would be southwesterly wind gust. And then on Friday, the winds will switch to the north and they'll still be fairly breezy at 25 miles per hour. So Thursday, Friday are the days we're highlighting, giving you a first alert. Those would be the breezy days if you're doing anything outside later this week. Let's talk temperatures. Uh, yeah, a little chilly. Uh, this is about average for the middle of January, but you know, cooler than we've been used to many of our days so far this month have been in the 60s, but highs today only around 59 degrees. That'll happen about 3 p.m. We'll drop down through the 40s fairly quickly this evening. The combination of light wind and a clear sky usually allows for cold temperatures at night. We'll wake up to 41 degrees tomorrow morning. I wouldn't doubt many neighborhoods around Las Vegas, especially on the east side and the south side, uh, falling to the upper 30s tomorrow morning. But tomorrow the sunshine continues and we've got a, a punching chance of uh, getting into the low 60s, I think, uh, for our Wednesday afternoon. Today, though, probably not going to stop just short of the 60 degree mark. We're aiming for 58 in North Las Vegas and Sunrise Manor down to the southwest, about 57 in Spring Valley, 56 in Rhodes Ranch, uh, Anthem, Green Valley, about 57, 58 degrees. And again, uh, these high temperatures will happen between three and four o'clock this afternoon. The winds light under 10 miles per Per hour. Highs in Parumpa about 54, Laughlin 62, Mesquite 51. It looks like temperatures tonight, like I said, in parts of the valley, especially on the south and the east side, could drop briefly to the upper 30s. But generally speaking, uh, tonight a couple degrees above where our temperatures were last night. Quiet weather pattern with lots of sunshine across the desert southwest. Uh, there's a storm system moving through the Great Lakes and impacting the northeast and parts of the east coast, uh, but it looks like it'll be a couple more days before our clouds really start to thicken up. That'll happen late Wednesday through Thursday. The moisture with that Thursday system stays to our north, but like we talked about earlier, we're going to pick up on some of the breezes with that system by Thursday afternoon. It looks like the winds are going to calm right back down, though, just in time for what should be a pretty nice weekend. Low 60s Saturday and Sunday uh, with fairly calm conditions. A nice weekend to plan things outside. Monday we're up into the mid 60s, but Dana, in the meantime, the next few afternoons a little cooler than most of us would like with highs in the upper 50s and low 60s.